Railroad Commissioner Ryan Sitton running for re-election. He spoke at the Midland County Republican Women's Luncheon today about what he sees in store for the future of the Basin. Big 2's Jocelyn Person joins us live with that report. Hi, Jocelyn. Hi, Katie. Ryan Sitton says he has high hopes for the economic future for the Basin, regardless of the conflict that we have with Iran. In the 2020 election, I will be the top state official on the ballot. And so that means I'm not just the railroad commissioner running for office around the state of Texas. I'm also a big part of the Texas Republican brand. Sitton has been railroad commissioner for more than five years. He says he and his party can improve the already thriving economy. Certainly have thing, opportunities to get better and improve. We also have worked really hard to be good public servants and to drive a thriving economy to open up opportunities for our kids. Sitton says the tensions with Iran can be beneficial to the local oil economy. Now the commodity prices are up a little bit because of the tension with Iran and that's, that's going to mean better economics for the Midland area. However, I don't think that that's going to have a massive impact long term because in the end, what's really driving the positives in the Midland economy are the really innovative production of the Midland operators. The oil production is the driving force of the basin, creating more jobs as oil workers increase their spending and invest in the local economy. In fact, the West Texas area have gotten much more efficient. They're getting more production out of the ground and better economics out of each well and out, out of each dollar spent. So right now around the world, as people are trying to produce more oil and natural gas, the best economics in the world are right here in the state of Texas, right here in the Midland area. Ryan Sitton will be on the ballot in the Republican primary on March 3rd. Reporting live in studio, Jocelyn Person, Big 2 News.